Hello everyone. Today we learn how to analysis and design of one story RCC building in ETAPS. So first step, we require a plan top view of the one floor building. If you are new, please subscribe my channel, share my channel, and click on bell icon. Let's start. So first of all, we consider a one floor building plan. So we consider like that. L shape and we have three rooms okay and this is five meter this is six meter and this is four meter and four meter okay you remember this plan because when we start to modeling this this drawing is erased so five meter six meter four meter four meter this is the top view and the building height is 3.5 meter and this is one story building okay first of all go to the new model and select indian units and codes click okay we um, we have a plan with non uniform span 5 meter 6 meter so we have to go custom grid spacing and edit grid okay now click here and first span is 5 meter and the second span is 6 meter and third is 0 if you choose uh, directly put spacing so you have third uh, grid you have to 0 because we have 3 lines ok so delete this D in Y direction we have 4 meter 4 meter and 0 and delete this for grid now you can see here in this picture we have 5 meter, 6 meter, 4 meter, 4 meter and we have to draw uh, this building plan on this grid and the building height is 1 story and 3.5 meter. Click OK. And this is the one story building plan. So the plan is ready. Plan is, it means uh, I want to say that our grid is according to our plan is ready. The first step is done define grid. The second step is defined material. In, in this building we use M20 material. So go to the define material, add new material and select country, India, concrete. M20 and click OK. These are the material property. If you want to change, you have to change this property from here. If not, please uh, take as default. So, so M20 material name and click OK. You can see here in this list M20 concrete material is defined. OK. The second step, first step is define grid, and the second step is define material. Third step is define cross section area of beam and column so go to define section property frame section and add new property and we choose rectangular column so click on rectangular and the title of this column and the material is m20 and the column size is 400 by 400 square column 400 by 400 Okay, the next step is uh, in column, we have to define reinforcement in this column. So we go to the reinforcement detailing from here directly. And this is column, so we select column. And from here we select FE charge for 115 uh, steel grade, but not defined. So click in three dots and add new steel FE. 415 add new material Indian concrete to change rubber and high strength yield steel FE 415 and ok title is FE 415 and the all data is same ok and ok now you have a option of FE 415 choose for main bar and ties bar 
okay all thing is keep at default and okay and okay so column is defined now add one more rectangular sorry square beam title is beam material is m20 and the size of the beam is 400 by 300 and choose the reinforcement as a beam design and the clear cover is least 25 for beam and choose fe15 fe 415 and click ok and ok and ok so first step is define grid the second step is define material third step is define frame section cross section if you want to design so you have also defined reinforcement inside the cross section the next step is to draw so we choose this is the draw icon for uh, beam so we select here beam and drag over the plan okay next this is the column and select property column and drag over the plan column is designed now you can see here one story building frame is modeling is done now the next step is provide support automatically default support is pin support you can see here all our pin so we go to the down key to the base and select the all joints and go to the assign join restrain and fix support then again go to the top plan by up key and zoom out zoom in you can see the support is changed the next step is provide slab so we have to define a uh, section property sorry material in section property slab section add a new slab the title is slab 120 mm and the material is m20 and the thickness is 120 mm and click ok and ok and select slab from here and change slab 120 and draw okay now our slab is modeling the next step is loading so we have this is a small one story building frame okay okay one more thing when we draw a small uh, a plan of the building where our plan of the building is rectangular so this is are not required so we delete this and again we draw the slab okay now we have to draw slab okay this is our the one story building plan. now the next step is loading we we apply on one story building only two loads dead load and live load so in dead load we have the uh, op option is self weight that was automatically uploaded by the uh, e tab and the next load in dead load is the parapet wall parapet wall load is the boundary wall at the so in dead load the self aid is automatically applied in the next load in dead load is wall load and the wall load and the slab load slab load self aid is automatically Assign but live load on the slab and live load on the sorry dead load on the walls sorry beams in this you can now you can understand one 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 more important thing in a single story building we cast wall here but these wall on the ground so the load of the wall is not on the structure that's why we don't apply wall load here but at the terrace we have a boundary of one meter wall approximately two kilonewton per meter udl uh, outer of the building so what we do and this is the dead load so we select the outer beams of the building and assign a frame udl 
इन डेड लोड एंड द इंटेंसिटी इज टू ओके अब नेक्स्ट इज द लाइव लोड ऑन द सेल्स दिस आर द सेल्स असाइन सेल्स लोड यूनिफॉर्म एंड द If the stair is not available according to IS code, uh, the live load is 0.75 on the cells. Okay, the load is now defined. Now we have to define load combination. Add and the load one load combination only we defined. This is the dead load plus live load and the factor of safety is one. 0.5 and the here factor is 1.5 1.5 now load combination that the all part is done now analysis and check the result after design this is the deformation diagram now you have can checks by animation okay now what we do we have to analyze after analysis we design rcc select combination and go to the design concrete and start design design start you can see here the only column we have some numbers you can see here only column and beam have some numbers these numbers are the reinforcement area in mm square but not on this slab because in e tab we don't have we don't able to design slab in e tab only beam and column so in beam you can see here six values the top three values of the top reinforcement and the top bottom value is the bottom reinforcement and this is the end reinforcement this is the center reinforcement this is the end the cut element and this is the uniform reinforcement and column you can check by right click on the beam and check the summary you can right click on the column and check the interaction curve and the check the demand capacity is 2.96 and you can check the uh, stresses in this slab due to combination and this is the distribution of slab uh, stress in slab due to combination and if you want to talk about the result go to the display and show table and go to the design you can check the result reinforcement directly after design the some values on the beam and column and you can check right click on the beam now you can check as a table form this is the concrete design i i want to require only beam summary concrete beam summary and according to is456 and this is the beam summary due to this combination minimum reinforcement this at the top is this due to combination bottom this is the bottom detail this is due to shear and this is the torsion for torsion from that is zero neglect the torsion and this is the data so this is the one story building analysis and design in e tabs if you have any doubt please comment and before comment please subscribe my channel thank you very much